in this chapter let's learn about another interesting topic which is distinct what is distinct the name as it suggests it's called unique give me the unique values that is what distinct means what if there is a scenario you want to find out the distinct values in a result set in that scenario you use the distinct keyword here i am saying select distinct order id from sales what that means is like don't repeat the order id numbers just give me all the unique order ids from the sales table you can mention more than one column after the distinct i am saying give me all the distinct sales date and order id combination from sales we know order id is unique within a sales date so for that for the order id and the sales date combination give me the distinct values you can mention as many columns as you want for that combination it gives you the distinct result set now let's check this on a demo okay let's go to our sales table so let me get sales date how many values we have seven rows but we the values are repeated so now i don't want them to be repeated i want unique values i say distinct sales date now see none of the values are repeated every one of the value is distinct first january you don't see that again first february you don't see that again 9th february no nope. second january no nope. like this you can do if you want to find out what are the distinct values based on multiple columns you can do that just mention the column name now for this group it gives you the distinct values okay so now it says for 1st february we have only one order for 9th february we have one order for 1st january we have one order and for 2nd january 1268 so for this group it just returns one value even though there are multiple values let's take the distinct out and see how many we we get we got seven rows but when we kept the distinct keyword it returns us the unique combination in that result set 